how to link downloadable files in Shopify. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you how simple it is to link the downloadable files into your store on Shopify. So here I'm going to let you see two different things. I'm going to let you see how we are going to upload some files to our Shopify store and get in links to put them as hyperlinks or uh, indirect links into the text also how we can get up uh, whether the digital products uploaded into our Shopify store so let's begin with the linking of the downloadable files what are we going to do is to head over the Shopify so we are going maybe to head over the blog so let's pretend that we have a blog I'm going to click on uh, pages or blog posts so i'm going to create a real quick a blog post so we are going to put up here the title test blog for example we're going to type in here write a, a command or a prompt me an article about clothes uh, for uh, let's say here uh, for the winter of 2024 i'm going to generate the blog content so what are we going to do is to wait for here keep that now we are going to click on the visibility click on save here we have added the blog uh, and now what i am going to do is basically to have a link so we can go ahead and uh, click on or select the text and link it or insert a link now everything is set the blog is added this is for the news now what are we going to do is to head over the content from here we are going to select the files and then we are going to click on upload files so Basically, we are going to see the downloads from here. Let's pretend that we are going to add a PDF. So this PDF is going to be uploaded. So I think that the number or not the number, but the type of the files that are going to be uploaded into your Shopify are not going to be very restricted. So you can go ahead and go with the format. So here we have uploaded successfully the file. How we can make that link or the downloadable link of that file. So this is the file. We can go ahead and click on copy link. We have copied that link. Now we are going to head over the blog post that we have here. This is just an example. You can go ahead and put it wherever you want. So you can go ahead and make it as a button, a, a hyperlink or whatever. So I'm going to select here. Now we are going to select the text that we are going to put it. For example, uh, I'm going to put up here an announcement like get your free, uh, let's say here, ebook here. So I'm going to make that text bold. Click on insert link. What are we going to do? Paste that link. So we are going to open it up on a new window. Put a link title. So free, let's say here, e commerce ebook. I'm going to click on insert link and boom. We're going to save. Then we're going to click on link. So we have here enter with a password. We have a password in our uh, store because we have no plan uh, selected yet. So I did not buy a plan. So you can go ahead to the preference or there are preferences under the sales channels on the online store and put up here the password. I have it. You are going to see the, um, as you can see here at the link, so what are we going to do is to head over the blog page so we are going to view that blog post 
here we have it now we are going to scroll down until we see the get your free ebook when you click on it you're going to see that it has opened that pdf file and obviously you can go ahead and save it save that file and download it as you want so this is it this is very simple to add the downloadable file you can add an image a ebook a pdf file a psd file whatever for this specific case you only need to head over the content and files and upload your file also you can go ahead and upload it from a url now everything is set for the downloadable file now how we can uh whether uh, update or upload some digital files you are going simply to head over the uh, search bar at the top and type in digital downloads and you're going to get the right to install this app which is going to be from the um, shopify developers now we are going to install this app this app will let you whether select the files uh, or the digital files to download them and make the purchase for them afterwards so whenever a client go ahead and set up a product or, or a digital products and buy it they will get the digital copy of this specific one so you are going to do the same thing we're going to add or import a product and get it right here but for the linking only you are going to follow up the method that i have showed you before which is heading over the content files upload that file and here we have it so let's go ahead and add a file or right there a downloadable or this downloadable file into our product page so we are going to head over the product add a product and now we are going to type in here a website template for example we are going to set up here a description uh i'm going to put up here a digital description like that so we are going to keep that a design for example now what are we going to do is to get for example the easy offer get your uh copy or free ebook here boom now we are going to select all that text make it bold insert the link put it here or get it right away so i'm going to click on save here the product does not have a uh, as you can see a photo so i'm going to add it I'm going to put the price of it and I'm not going to track the quantity and I am going to disable the shipping for it because it is a digital product. Just an example. So we are going to head over the content files. Now, as you can see, we have uh, the uh, image that we have uploaded. It is going to be also uh, counted. So I'm going to get this, head over the products, select this one and link it here so boom insert link save i'm going to preview and we have the preview we're going to see it right there when you click on it it will take you to that page so that was basically uh, all for today's video thank you guys for watching i hope that you have enjoyed the content and i hope to see you soon on the next one